Hello and welcome to Healthy Lifestyle Tips, where we explore all things health and wellness. Today's topic is, why pregnant women pee so much. If you are pregnant or have been pregnant before, you may have noticed that you need to use the bathroom much more frequently than usual. This is a common phenomenon that affects many pregnant women, and it can be caused by several factors. Firstly, during pregnancy, the female body undergoes many changes to support the growth and development of the fetus. One of these changes is an increase in blood volume. The body needs to produce more blood to support the growth of the placenta and the developing fetus. This increase in blood volume can be up to 50% higher than normal for a pregnant woman. With an increase in blood volume, the kidneys have to work harder to filter the blood and remove waste products. This increased work leads to a higher urine output, which means that pregnant women produce more urine than usual. The increased blood volume also means that the kidneys filter more blood, which results in a higher amount of waste products being removed from the body. These waste products then get excreted from the body in the form of urine. Secondly, during pregnancy, the uterus grows to accommodate the developing fetus. As the uterus expands, it can start to press against nearby organs, including the bladder. The bladder is located just in front of the uterus and is responsible for storing urine until it's ready to be expelled from the body. As the uterus grows and puts pressure on the bladder, it can make pregnant women feel like they need to urinate even when their bladder isn't full. This sensation is known as urinary urgency and is a common symptom of pregnancy. The pressure on the bladder can also make it harder for the bladder to hold urine, which can cause pregnant women to need to use the bathroom more frequently. As the pregnancy progresses, the baby's head may also start to press against the bladder. This is because the baby's head is located in the lower part of the uterus, which is closest to the bladder. As the baby grows and gets bigger, its head can start to put more pressure on the bladder, which can further increase the need to urinate. Thirdly, during pregnancy, the body experiences significant hormonal changes to support the growth and development of the fetus. One of the hormones that play a crucial role in pregnancy is progesterone. Progesterone is produced by the ovaries and the placenta during pregnancy. It helps prepare the uterus for implantation and supports the growth and development of the fetus. However, progesterone also has effects on other parts of the body, including the urinary tract. Progesterone causes the smooth muscles in the urinary tract to relax. This relaxation affects the muscles in the bladder and the urethra. The bladder is a muscular sac that stores urine until it is released through the urethra during urination. The urethra is a tube that carries urine from the bladder to the outside of the body. When the muscles in the bladder and urethra relax, it becomes harder to hold urine in the bladder. This can result in a feeling of urgency to urinate and more frequent trips to the bathroom. In addition to causing muscle relaxation, progesterone also affects the sensation of needing to urinate. Normally, the bladder sends signals to the brain when it is getting full, and this signals the need to urinate. However, during pregnancy, the signals can become distorted due to the relaxation of the bladder muscles. This means that pregnant women may feel like they need to urinate even when their bladder isn't full, further contributing to the frequent urination. In addition to these factors, urinary tract infections, UTIs, are a common health concern for pregnant women, as they are more susceptible to developing them than non-pregnant women. This is because the body undergoes a number of changes during pregnancy, including hormonal changes that can affect the urinary tract. During pregnancy, the uterus expands and puts pressure on the bladder and urinary tract. This can cause urine to become trapped in the bladder, creating an ideal environment for bacteria to grow. Additionally, hormonal changes during pregnancy can affect the urinary tract, making it more susceptible to infection. Symptoms of UTIs in pregnant women can include pain or burning during urination, a frequent need to urinate, and cloudy or strong-smelling urine. It's important to seek treatment for UTIs during pregnancy, as untreated infections can lead to more serious health problems such as kidney infections and preterm labor. Treatment for UTIs during pregnancy usually involves a course of antibiotics prescribed by a healthcare provider. It's important to complete the full course of antibiotics as prescribed, even if symptoms improve, to ensure that the infection is completely eradicated. So, what can pregnant women do to manage their frequent trips to the bathroom? 
Here are a few tips. 1. Drink plenty of water. Although it may seem counterintuitive, drinking plenty of water can actually help reduce the frequency of urination. When you're dehydrated, your body holds onto urine, which can make you feel like you need to use the bathroom more frequently. 2. Avoid caffeine and alcohol. These drinks can irritate the bladder and increase the need to urinate. 3. Empty your bladder completely. When you use the bathroom, make sure you empty your bladder completely. This can help reduce the need to go again soon after. 4. Practice pelvic floor exercises. Strengthening the muscles that support the bladder can help reduce the need to urinate. 5. Wear comfortable clothing. Tight clothing can put pressure on the bladder and increase the need to urinate. Opt for loose-fitting clothing instead. In conclusion, frequent urination is a common phenomenon among pregnant women, and it can be caused by a combination of factors such as increased blood volume, pressure on the bladder, and hormonal changes. Pregnant women can manage their symptoms by following a few simple tips, such as drinking plenty of water, avoiding caffeine and alcohol, emptying their bladder completely, practicing pelvic floor exercises, and wearing comfortable clothing. Thank you for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more health and wellness tips.